Hi, I'm Justin Hawkins from Hot Leg, and you're watching Metal Hammer TV. Small farm. <laughs> So, what have you been up to, Justin? Seeing as, seeing as there's a, it's, been, it's been a while since yeah. we've reacquainted with you. It's been a long time. Um, I've been working on uh, my new man rock group, Hot Leg. Are you excluding ladies? Uh, no, <laughs> d d only because uh, the people in the band are generally generic male. Yeah, of the male species. Male men. <laughs> <laughs> with an L.E. So, uh, in putting this record together, I mean, you've done a lot of stuff beforehand. I mean, th did you regret any of the the Eurovision stuff or anything like that? Because that, that was the last musical endeavour that we yeah, had. Yeah, uh, that was. I was one half of the duet on that, and um, Past I thought, the I thought it was. Her. No, no. I mean, <laughs> I, 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 she, she did a better job than I did. I was fucking rubbish. But um, yeah, I, I, I don't think I'll be doing that again. And um, Hot Leg, of course, this is something you recorded all on your own. Am I right in saying that you recorded all the parts or wrote all of the parts? Yeah, recorded. Um, recorded and wrote? Yeah, I wrote all the music parts, yeah. So, a couple of the songs um, a friend of mine helped out with the lyrics, but I wrote and recorded everything else. Did, did, you, have, did you ever have any kind of stir-crazy moments? Yeah. I, I can imagine, yeah. like, just being locked in a recording studio on yourself, especially, like, listening to your falsettos over and over again. Yeah. Must yeah, have like the mad scientist it in, went a bit, in, in yeah, his laboratory. It's definitely easy to get sort of uh, get a bit um, confused by it all. But then, you know, that's part of the magic. I and mean, I, I think I recorded a lot of stuff and kind of just kept adding to it and right. building it and then it became really elaborate and huge and then I just had to pull it all away because it was too self indulgent if that's possible. Right. You know. yeah, would, you, would you just step in on the flamboyance gas? Yeah, everything got cranked up a little bit more, and it was just really intense. What was the most ridiculous thing that you recorded? Because well, this is it. It's, it's always I, I, I'm not that you need to sound like you were disappearing up your own bum. No, or, no. I mean, like, all it was that. I, 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 really, it's just about vocal arrangements. I was just kind of right. doing, doing hundred part harmonies and things like that, which, <laughs> and like singing from the very lowest part I can go to to the very highest, and um, and but on everything, and it's just. Sounded like a, a male voice choir with guitar solos. Actually, we were just flicking through the record, and um, there there are vocal parts that are just so out there. Like, how, how do you come up with these parts? Like, you, you mentioned like being able to come up with a hundred part harmonies, and you know. Oh, it's just time. I think if you just sort of concentrate and spend the time, you can get get stuff. Yeah, just keep going. And uh, how much? How much does this sound like the previous band? Um, the previous band, the um, Darkness. Yeah, the, the last band. It's got the know. same singer as the Darkness. Yes, so yeah. So there's, there's a similarity there. It's about so high. Yeah, he's, uh, he looks a <laughs> lot like me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Inexplicably. Yeah. Um, it's uh, it's like it only more. It's a souped up version of it. It's a more tricked out version of it. In what, in what ways does it kind of crank out the riffs a bit more? Or yeah, the, riff, the riffs are, are, are harder. The um, solos go on for longer, and there's more notes in them. Yeah, I, I, um, do, I do pick up on that. Oh there's yeah, some cool. Serious, yeah, my guitar playing is improved, um, and uh, I think the songs are catchier. Um, That's bold claim, man. No, yeah, definitely. I mean, I stand by it. I think it's uh, it's a really really strong album. Awesome. Uh, something that we did notice you haven't lost is your sense of humour. Writing track titles I like uh, I, don't know, I don't know what you mean. Yeah, of course not. <laughs> gay, gay in the eighties, and um, I've met Jesus. Yeah, I as think well. I've met Jesus is going to be the Christmas single. What well, I think next to uh, I've, <laughs> I've met Santa. I think it's about yeah, the closest yeah. thing that you can <laughs> get. Yeah. So, so I, I mean, um, did you ever? Because uh, I know you were kind of lambasted for it in the darkness, mm. and, it, and it was like um, people wouldn't take notice of how good the songs were. One, one in particular that springs to mind is Knockers. Knockers is a fucking fantastic song, yeah. but because it's called Knockers. Knockers, you might as well call it Wobbly Navy's bit. Yeah, I think that might have been like what alienated people. Did, did, but, did, um, did it ever make you kind of want to pull, pull back the reins on that a little bit? No, I don't think so because I, I think that would just be. Um, What's the expression? Copping out, you know, just be, yeah. It just be, um, it wouldn't be real. I think the people that did like it would be really disappointed if that happened. 
I mean, uh, you've never felt the need to write your Nirvana stroke Alice in Chains melancholy every song, vocal. Every song is my version of that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, have you never, because I know you've gone through a lot, but did you never want to put that in the music instead of uh, your, your, tra- your traditional trademark sound? I mean, some of it's pretty dark on this one, Paul. Yeah. Pretty dark, kind of dark. Is it? No, it's not dark. Darkish. Dark, I mean, it's all about the subject matter, really, isn't it? It's like, you think about things like, um, I know it's not in the same uh, genre, but like, think about Beach Boys, and all that stuff is just really dark, dark yeah, subject true, matters yeah. with uh, really sort of playful melodies. Um, I don't know where the darkness is, I don't even know. Is it dark? Is it not dark? It's, I, what, I've never, I don't know, I just write whatever's there and whatever I feel like, you know. 